what, what kind of compliments? Like dewy? So like, oh, your skin is glowing, and your skin is dewy. And then some like American friends would be like, are you wearing a lot of lotion? And I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Charlotte, and I am here with the ever beautiful, ever graceful Kimchi. Hi, thank you for having me. And we are here after RuPaul's DragCon in New York City, and I got a chance to visit Kimchi at her booth, and of course, she had an amazing line, an amazing setup, and an amazing outfit. So every DragCon, I try to do like a different concept and an outfit that matches the concept of my booth. So the concept this year was Dreams for New York Drag Con. So I had a black sequin backdrop with little air balloons and cloth floating. And tell me a little bit about your name because kimchi is obviously something that I love and eat at almost every meal, even on top of my pizza. You get it. She gets it. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I, you've probably asked a million times, but why kimchi? Of course, so kimchi is the national dish of Korea. So when I was picking my drag name, I wanted something that sounded feminine but represents my culture at the same time. Yeah. And yeah, I think it was a good choice because I've had a lot of people like, oh, I didn't know what kimchi was until like I oh, saw yeah. the menu and then I recognized it and tried it. And now I know what it is. That's so. awesome. Yeah, I noticed that in every restaurant, there's like kimchi cornbread now. Yeah. So, it's so trendy. Kimchi fries, kimchi like kimchi tacos, yeah. like kimchi's on everything. Yeah. Now that it's evening, you must be tired. You ready to unwind? Do you want to get unready? This is the moment I've been waiting for all day. Now that we are in our PJs, um, we are gonna get unready and remove that legendary mug of yours. Alright, can't get it off soon enough. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, actually, how does that affect your skin? Because you have a lot of makeup on and how does that affect your skin in any way? It really dries out my skin throughout the day. What is your routine before and how has it changed? So before, after I would take off the makeup, mm -hmm. I would just do a little moisturizer and that was it. And my skin used to like crackle really bad and what do you call this like, like a little like flaky skin just like oh, peeling yeah. off yeah. and then there actually used to be scabs like around my eye oh my gosh yeah from yeah. like excessive like lash glue and... oh that makes sense okay and do you have scabs now no mm -hmm. after using like the cave like beauty routine my mm -hmm. skin is so good i actually get a lot of compliments on it oh what? let's get started i would right. love to see how you get unready I'll be getting unready with you, but I'm curious to see how you, you do everything because you have a lot more makeup and you have just probably more steps than me. I think so. Yeah. Just a smidge. <laughs> yeah. so it turns out there is a man underneath the biological woman here. I feel like my face is like double the size of yours. What are you talking about? Like whopper Junior, triple whopper. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll go a little bit up closer to the camera. Oh, perfect. All right, so what's the first step? Taking the lashes off. Okay. Here it comes. For a lot of like biological women, they use fine glitter that's safe to use around the eye. But a lot of drag queens use chunky craft glitter. Mm -hmm. So if you get in your eye, you can scratch your cornea and you could do irreversible damages. But we still use it anyway. <laughs> I'm going to use tape mm -hmm. and I'm going to gently dab on the glitter to make sure every single speck of glitter is gone. We've taken off your lashes and the glitter, so now we're going to use an oil cleanser to remove everything. Using the oil cleanser is like less harsher on my face because mm -hmm. um, before you're taking the makeup remover and just wiping really hard mm -hmm. at it. Mm -hmm. But this just like, melts every single way and it also feels really hydrating yeah. and massaging at the same time. Oh wow, you use a lot. <laughs> you must go through bottles of I it. I do go through a lot of it. Oh wow. Okay, I want this okay. much. That's what I Ooh. use. It's so funny, when you go to like CVS or any of these like drugstores, there's like walls and walls of cleansing tissues. That's true. But I think it's because people are just using cleansing tissues to wash everything off and they don't even like really wash the face with water. Yeah. And they just go to sleep. Just like is, wipe, wipe, wipe. Yeah. And then it's really bad for your skin to do that mm -hmm. because you need to have, you have so many pollutants, makeup, excess oil that's like being produced and you just need to rinse everything off and remove everything cleanly. I usually if I'm home, I just like hop in the shower. Right. So then it just like washes everything away oh, yeah, instead of yeah. like wasting a towel. But... The next step is to remove 
next up is I still have some glue and like white underliner and then I'm sure like powder like everywhere else that I haven't like reached yet so I use foam cleanser mm -hmm. to completely take everything off yeah I love this one because it's super soft and like luxurious Ooh. they say that if you take 20 to 30 minutes to put on your face like makeup you should spend the same amount of time and care to remove that and so, I mean, <laughs> you don't have to spend a whole hour. <laughs> so the next step would be you to exfoliate. Yes, and this is um, a product that I introduced you to. She looked it up, and it's been a game changer. <laughs> okay, tell me why, because I love this too. But I always love hearing what how other people think okay. of it. First of all, it smells good. Mm -hmm. I'm all about like things that smell nice, and it smells it's like so, lemons. It does. Mm -hmm. And it's so easy to use. You just gotta stick your finger in it and it's double sided. Mm -hmm. There's like the exfoliating side and then there's like the massaging yeah. side. And then I just take this and I gently pour on my skin. And sometimes I bring this into the shower mm -hmm. and I'm like. <laughs> oh. Yeah, because like the elbows are all ashy. That's actually a smart idea. Yeah. I just did it with my own. Um... Your feet? Yeah. <laughs> Especially like after wearing sandals, like in the city, oh, you know, yeah, it gets yeah. dirty so quickly. Definitely. Definitely. Cool. So this is actually infused with um, vitamin C, mm -hmm. so a natural brightener, and then this is a physical exfoliant part. Oh. So it removes the dead skin cells on the surface. So the reason why you probably think it's a game changer is because mm -hmm. exfoliation is a key to just brighter skin. It removes that surface layer and also it helps your other skincare products absorb better. Next up is a toner. Okay. And my favorite one is the beauty water by mm -hmm. Sun and Park because it smells nice. Mm -hmm. I, I use this religiously every day too to remove my makeup actually and tone. That's crazy. I wish my makeup could be that light. Cheers. Ding! <laughs> It's amazing because you think that you just wash twice mm -hmm. and with toner or without this you think okay there's nothing left on my face but like it's already it's like brown oh my god me too yeah next is my favorite part sheet mask sheet masking okay how often do you do this i try to do it every day yeah. and if i'm flying on planes and whatnot i always do one on the plane every time i get on you do plane. yeah that's hardcore. This is um, made with green tea. You could mm -hmm. actually—it's not mold, guys. It's actually grill green tea embedded into the mask. I like how yours like goes up to your and mine is like. <laughs> there's still like a long journey ahead. <laughs> it's not that bad. <laughs> I actually made this mask. Maybe I should make a bigger one for you. <laughs> Please. No. I was like, is my hairline receding or is my face just like that big that like the mask can't reach like the rest of my forehead? So after 20 minutes, we just mm -hmm. remove it. Peel it off. Yeah. Oh, are you doing the heart? Yeah. Okay. It feels so nice and hydrating. Yeah. And I don't know if this is gross, but sometimes if there's like essence left, like I take it and like rub it all over my body. That's a major hack, yeah. Is it? <laughs> you know, if you put your fingers in like the pouch where it comes out of, like yeah. there's so much extra essence and you just put on your... Oh. Sometimes people use this as a neck mask after. Oh, that's smart. Like this. Would it be gross if I like put it on my foot after like... No, that's a hack. We talked about it. Oh yeah, there you go. Oh yeah. Oh my God, so much essence. Yeah. Just put a few pats. Yeah. Look at you patting. This is, <laughs> this is a way to get it all into your skin, fully mm -hmm. absorbed without tugging or pulling your skin. Without damaging your skin. Mm -hmm. I always never forget my neck. Always forget my neck. <laughs> so the next step is? Eye cream. All right, this is your favorite step? I think so. Okay. After, um wearing makeup for a long time, especially lashes. Mm -hmm. um, putting eye cream around my eyes, it really like soothes and mm -hmm. calms down the irritation. Yeah, I can't believe when you told me that you used to have scabs around your eyes. Yeah, it's like really huge, like chunky ones. There are no pictures of it because I what? didn't take pictures. <laughs> but it wasn't pretty. It was because of the pulling from the lashes? I don't know, I think it's like a combination of like makeup, pulling from the lashes mm -hmm. and then not taking care of my eyes really mm -hmm. well. 
Yeah, and then now with eye cream, you feel like it's improved? I think so, definitely. Yeah. I haven't had like the scab problem. And also the makeup goes on bad around the eyes. Oh yeah, that's the thing about skincare. I think people think, oh, it's skin, you know, it's I, I like makeup. Why do I have to worry about it? But it actually makes your makeup look better. It's true. Yeah, and it makes it go on like butter. <laughs> Here's another trick too. Mm -hmm. Like kind of put it around your orbital bone too, so you don't have to go up next to your wa water line. Okay. Yeah, I think that'll also help it. Oh, it's very tingly right now. Oh. A long day today. <laughs> this has like ginseng in it. Oh, I like it. It smells like humbug. It's um, kind of like medicinal, Korean medicinal. It does, onions. yeah. This is the, the serum step. Yeah, I just like it because it makes my skin feel tingly too. Yeah, it makes it yeah. All alive when, I, <laughs> when it tingles. It actually has 20.5% vitamin C in it. That's why you're feeling the tingling. Mm -hmm. It's actually like chemically exfoliating your skin. Okay. Yeah. Okay, now the last and final step, finally. It's the cream. The cream. Okay, so the important part of putting a moisturizer at the very end is you just lock in all of that those products you just put on your face. It always amazes me how much you use. I have a large face. <laughs> I love it. Okay, see. Hey, you do it like me. No, do you do that too? I, I know. <laughs> it must be a Korean thing. No. I just have a lot of surface to cover, so I was like, <laughs> let me distribute the uh, soldiers across the yeah. battlefield. So this one is, do you like this texture? I do. It's super like soft and mm -hmm. really covers your skin. It's like hydrating, locks everything in. And that was my transformation from a biological woman to a biological woman. <laughs> okay, how do you feel? I feel great. My yeah. skin finally feels like, like it can breathe thing. again. Yeah. Thank you, Kimchi, for joining me. I had an amazing time getting unready. Thank you. I feel like I learned a lot. Yeah, I feel like I learned a lot too. So for any of you who are watching and are inspired by our routine or have any questions, please comment down below. And also, if you want to follow Kimchi, make sure to follow her on Instagram, kimchi underscore chic. And what else? Have it, any last words? Get rich or die trying. Peace <laughs> out. <laughs> All right, peace. Bye. Oh, the heart? The heart.